the terrible three and a half years that are coming upon the world. An interpretation of the Holy Bible. A Middle Eastern Antichrist signs an agreement guaranteeing the security of Israel for seven years. But it lasts for only three and a half years. He shall make a strong covenant with many for one week, and for half of the week he shall put an end to sacrifice and offering. And on the wing of abominations shall come one who makes desolate, until the decreed end is poured out on the desolator. This is a week of years, that is, seven years, of which one half is three and a half years. This beast leads a coalition of ten nations against the Jewish state, which it oppressed for three and a half years. He shall speak words against the Most High, and shall wear out the saints of the Most High, and shall think to change the times and the law. And they shall be given into his hand for a time, times, and half a time. A time, times and a half time equals 1260 days, or three and a half years. This political, Economic and religious oppressions will last for three and a half years, until the Israelis come to the end of their strength. An angel of God raised his right hand and his left hand toward heaven and swore by him who lives forever that it would be for a time, times, and half a time, and that when the shattering of the power of the holy people comes to an end, all these things would be finished. Nevertheless, an important remnant of the Israeli population is protected and nourished by God for three and a half years. The woman fled into the wilderness, where she has a place prepared by God, in which she is to be nourished for 1260 days. The woman was given the two wings of the great eagle so that she might fly from the serpent into the wilderness to the place where she is to be nourished for a time, and um, times, and half a time. Thus, the nations occupy the capital city, Jerusalem, including the Temple Mount, for forty-two months or three and a half years. Rise and measure the Temple of God and the altar and those who worship there, but do not measure the court outside the Temple. Leave that out, for it is given over to the nations, and they will trample the holy city for forty-two months. During the same three and a half years, two Israelite preachers prophesy and operate miracles against their enemies. I will grant authority to my two witnesses, and they will prophesy for one thousand two hundred sixty days clothed in sackcloth. They have the power to strike the earth with every kind of plague as often as they desire. And when they have finished their testimony the beast that rises from the bottomless pit will make war on them and conquer them and kill them. These two are apparently the ancient prophets. Elijah and Moses or Enoch who returned from heaven to call the Jewish nation to repentance. During this same period of time, the Antichrist forcefully imposes a new world order on many nations. The beast was given a mouth-uttering haughty and blasphemous words and it was allowed to exercise authority for 42 months. It opened its mouth to utter blasphemies against God, blaspheming his name and his dwelling, that is, those who dwell in heaven. Also it was allowed to make war on the saints and to conquer them. And authority was given it over every tribe and people and language and nation. 
one month following those three and a half years, the Antichrist and his coalition are completely destroyed. The wicked shall act wickedly. And none of the wicked shall understand, but those who are wise shall understand. And from the time that the regular burnt offering is taken away and the abomination that makes desolate is set up, there shall be 1,290 days. Jesus said, You see the abomination of desolation spoken of by the prophet Daniel, standing in the holy place. 6 weeks later, the nations are judged, and Jesus Christ inaugurates his messianic reign, with his capital city of Jerusalem. Blessed is he who waits and arrives at the 1335 days. But go your way till the end, and you shall rest and shall stand in your allotted place at the end of the days.